Good morning, bitches! It's Britmas Day 7. I honestly can't believe I've done seven days and I'm way more awake than I was yesterday, but I know I'm gonna go inside and crash. So I don't really know what's in store for today. It's gonna be kind of the same as yesterday, but I don't know the end video. I might have a rant about MAC Cosmetics. That might be the topic for later today because I saw a video last night and I'm pretty salty about it. So maybe that might be what we talk about later. If my battery doesn't die, I'm going to show you guys like my morning. It's technically morning out right now, but it'd be my nighttime skincare routine. So I might show you guys that if my camera doesn't die. And then when I get up, you'll see me work out and all that sort of stuff again. Good morning again. It is 2.45 and I just woke up. Today's just the day that I just don't feel like working out today. Like I have no ambition. My whole body is sore today, but I'm gonna do it anyways. I don't know what workout's in store for today, but hopefully it's not cardio. My luck is going to be. So I'm gonna go drink my pre-workout now. They're working on the floor, so you can probably hear that going on. So I'll show you guys that little update as well. How's the floor going today, Lava? Good, buddy. Good. 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 So you did this today, right? This one? Right, just these two rows? This one, this one? And then the whole perimeter. Oh, I know. We've covered that already, Lava. Yeah, but you showed us on that whole Oh, well the perimeter is done now. I got Don't mind the boobies today, because I've got no clean sports bras. So we're just wearing a cami today. All right, so I'm just chilling in my room. Don't judge the way that it looks. My house is a freaking disaster right now. But I just got done working out and I figured this would be a good time to rant about this because no one's home at the moment. <laughs> so, Matt Cosmetics, they just announced that they were bringing back their Patrick Powder. And the reason that I wanted to talk about this today was because I had every intention of purchasing the Patrick Powder. And this right here is exactly what ruins collaborations for me because a brand like MAC Cosmetics, they're a very well-known brand. To me, MAC Cosmetics has always been really high up on the totem pole. So I have a lot of like respect for MAC when it comes to being a brand itself. So when they announced that they were bringing back their Patrick Powder, I was really excited about it because I initially missed their first launch of it. I was so disappointed. I looked everywhere for it. It sold out everywhere. It was a really sought after product and everybody was loving it. So once they said they were bringing it back in different packaging, I was fucking hyped over it. Well then, I was watching a video last night. It's a friend of mine on here. It's Sarah Smiles Loves Makeup. Go check her out. I'll leave her in the description box. She is like a diehard, like she supports so many different brands. She always supports collaborations and she ended up buying three of the new, like the new Patrick powders that just launched. So they had the new packaging and she still has her original one. So here's what really like threw me over the edge. So she had her original Patrick powder and she hasn't been using it because you can't get it anymore. So now she's super excited because she could start using it again. And she went into detail about how when she purchased her products this time, they were a little bit more expensive. 
she mentioned that when she bought her initial Patrick powder, it was $34. So you got one fluid ounce for $34. Now they have new packaging. You get half the amount of product and it's $39. Like, how are you going to raise a price for half the amount of product? And I feel like the original packaging was better. But this is where it's just like, what the fuck? But this is the type of shit that's ruining it for all collaborations. Like this type of shit puts such a bad taste in your mouth about collaborations because it just makes you feel like brands are ripping you off because they're collaborating with people. And I mean, come on, like you couldn't use the same amount of product. You couldn't do it the same price. Like I don't understand why they would raise the price, change the packaging. Like have they ever heard if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I mean, I'm just so annoyed about the whole situation and this is such first world problems. I know that, but it's just so disappointing to see because I would love to support Patrick Starr and he has been somebody I've followed for a really long time. And I think that's another reason why I'm so like salty about it is because I wanted to support this product and Patrick Star and I was so excited about it and then Matt Cosmetics fucks us over pretty much so that's the type of shit that I cannot deal with when it comes to makeup collaborations like it always seems like brands just hike up the price they don't really look at the quality of the product and I mentioned this in a video I think it was yesterday's video or the day before I'm not really into reviewing collaborations anymore because I don't feel like brands or anything really focus on the quality or the consumer. I think they're just looking for money, which they're a business, I get it. But at the same time, if you wanna sell these products, don't piss off your customers. So I'm just like, I'm just so disappointed. So I wanted to talk about that because I know there's gonna be some people that run out and buy it just because they were excited like I was. But as soon as I saw that, I'm just like, nope. That just makes me not wanna support the brand. I don't know, it just seems like really shady to me. So that's just my little rant for the day. So now I'm going to jump in the shower. I'm going to um, get ready for work and edit this video. So tomorrow's video is going to be a Disney World haul. This is pre-recorded. It's not gonna have like the Vlogmas intro or anything. It's already uploaded and everything. I have a wedding to film tomorrow, so I'm not gonna have any time to do anything. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and this little rant. I was gonna do like my candle haul and stuff, but I just don't have time today. So that will come probably on Sunday, like candle haul. I got a few makeup products and We'll include that at another day. So we have a bunch more days to go. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you guys tomorrow.